first real holiday celebration. Part 1. My daughters moved in with us in late November 2004 after living in a bad foster care situation and then in a van with their mom who was a prostitute using drugs. Things were still very fresh to them. They were still settling into their new home and were amazed at the simple things like eating, playing with toys that were theirs and wearing nice clothes. When the Christmas tree went up, they didn't have any clue what it was. They thought it was cute and enjoyed decorating it and looking at it but other than that. I have no idea. When we talked about the jolly old man they were clueless about that as well. They couldn't believe such a thing was achievable. They were four and five years old at this point and had never celebrated Christmas before. We took them to the fun mall for a visit with Santa Claus. They asked, Dad, that man really brings us gifts? Of course, I explained and told them the whole story. I was really bothered by the fact that they came from a foster home and never got a single present, a tree or any of the traditions associated with it. When we picked up the girls from the foster home, the foster mom didn't give us anything except a bag of men's tube socks. No toys, dolls, nothing. First real holiday celebration. Part 2. Gradually stacks of presents gathered under the tree, and on Christmas Eve we put out milk and cookies for Santa Claus. They were very doubtful about the whole plan and were questioning the whole thing and trying to find flaws in my story. We were listening to holiday music and reading stories and they kept running to the front window. I thought they were looking for Saint Nick. Finally, I said, Santa won't come till later when you're asleep. Sanitize 3. When the girls went to sleep, I put on my big work boots and stomped around in the fireplace. I left some dirty boot prints on the white carpet leading to the cookies, took a bite, drank some milk, and went to sleep. Sanitize sentence 1. I love doing fun things while watching videos. They took me downstairs to see the footprints and the half-eaten snack. He's legit. He's real. They didn't care about the gifts at all. They were caught up in the fun and that was cool with me.